Good morning. It's Wednesday morning. And boy, am I glad that I park in a garage because uh, it's a little frosty out today. And I did not have to scrape frost off my car, which is super cool. So I'll be very happy about that, especially when it gets to be like real winter and starts snowing like tomorrow. And I won't have to scrape snow off my car either. Yay! Super great. So, it occurred to me that I introduced you to all five of my cats, but I haven't introduced you to my dogs yet. We have three dogs. I'll put pictures of them in this video, just like I did with the cats. Um, of course I have pictures of all my pets. I have more pictures of the pets than I have of me, or my boyfriend, or probably almost anything. Um, so, the first dog is the oldest dog. His name is Saru. Uh, that's Japanese. It means monkey because when he was a little baby puppy, he apparently used to make monkey noises. I didn't meet him when he was a puppy. He's my boyfriend's dog. Um, he's very old now. I think he's like 12. Uh, he's a German Shepherd mix. And... We're getting a little bit concerned for him because he's having some problems getting up the steps. His uh, litter mate, his sister, died maybe almost a year ago, I think. So he's getting old. We're a little concerned. Our second dog, Suka. name is just a, a female Japanese name. Um, she's his daughter, and we also used to have her mom. Her name was Mika, which is a Japanese name. It means fire, elemental fire or something like that. Um, she died a few years ago, um, and she was a husky mix. So Suka is a Husky German Shepherd mix. Mix mix. She's a little older. She's, a, I think, like eight or nine. Um, and she doesn't do well on her own. So we were, obviously, we know Saru, her dad, is getting older. And eventually he's not going to be around anymore. We'll be very sad. But we didn't want Suka to be just completely left alone if something catastrophic happened and Saru just killed over dead. So, a little over a year ago, we went to the pound and we adopted, we rescued a little baby Jackawawa. <laughs> uh, his name is Kitsune. Uh, that's uh, also a Japanese word. It means fox. Um, he is uh, he's now about two years old. He was about a year old, just under a year old, like ten months or so when we got him. Um, he's a very tiny little puppy, and he loves to play with the big dogs. Get super excited. Um, oh, this was super cute. I will never forget the first day that we brought him home, um, and he got to sleep in the bed because all the cats and the dogs sleep on the bed. I get like this much space in the bed. Um, anyway, so the first day he got to sleep in the bed, and then 
I swear, the next morning when he woke up, it was, it was literally like he was so surprised that he was still at a nice house. He didn't wake up in the pound. And his face, he was just like, I'm still here. It was super cute. So adorbs. Anyway, he's a little bitty dog. And he is convinced that he's a big dog. And he loves to play with the big dogs and run. And get chased by Suka. Their favorite game is uh, Chase Me. He's very fast. And super maneuverable. He runs in the yard and he goes pew when he turns. <sighs> anyway, so those are our three dogs. And the other day, Kitsu was sitting on my lap and Obsidian decided to jump up on my lap and push the dog away. And so Kitsu ended up sitting like super close up towards my belly on my lap and Obsidian was sitting out towards my knees and <laughs> my lap's not that big! Like, the little dog or a cat can fit in my lap, but not both. And <laughs> Obsidian fell off, except she decided she didn't want to fall off and she used her front claws to hold on to my thighs. And so now I have a big puncture on the top of my thigh and uh, it hurt really bad but anyway i'm at work now so uh that was a lot of babbling okay thanks bye